up, guys? Kevin here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to change the receiver on the Acrobee 75 HD. So uh, we have a lot of customers, they have the DJI V2 remote, and they want to use the, uh, the O3 internal receiver um, to bind to their DJI remote. So the hardware, we already have the wire uh, set up ready. And the only things you have to do is just go to Betafry and change some setting, and then it's good to go uh, to use the, the DJI Remote V2. So let's uh, start uh, the setting. I will show you how to do it step by step. So first of all, uh, you need to have the Betafry configurator and then use USB to connect to the fright controller. And after you connect to the fright controller, it will show up here, B-Brain BLV4 HD ELRS. So connect and first step, go to port. Uh, under these sections, you have to disable uh, on UART2. This is the uh, UART2 is, is connecting to the internal ELRS receiver. And then the wire on the, on the front controller to the DJI uh, SBUS signal port is on this one. So turn on UART1. This is connected to the, the, the O3 air unit and click save and then the next step will be go to receiver tab in here change crossfire to sbus and click save and reboot and after that it's done uh, and also make sure go to your uh, goggle uh, check the setting on the sbus signal it makes sure it's on the normal mode not the fast sbus mode because the setting on uh, the fret controller uh, from the factory default, it's it's using the normal S bus, and then if you if if on the uh, goggle setting it choose fast S bus, then you will not getting any stick input. And the other things I want to mention here is uh, we also do a lot of tests uh, to compare the uh, whip antenna to the DJI O3 uh, original antenna. I, I feel the range is actually pretty pretty similar so uh, if you are not doing long range then i would say this uh, whip antenna is totally good to use um i mean this drone can only go up to like three minutes of flight time so it's definitely not a long range uh whoop. so um i think it should be fine for this antenna to use so yeah if you guys have any questions uh, leave a comment let us know all right thanks for watching